Hi there, this is Ranjit and I have the Moto G5 Plus with me and in this video we'll be doing the gaming review with the temperature test. I didn't want to do a gaming review uh, but yesterday I posted a FAQ video and most of you wanted that I do a gaming review. So let's start and we're going to play uh, these uh, heavy games and let's start with this new game that is known as Skill Shot uh, Bravo. So this is Skill Shot uh, Bravo. And as you can see, get these uh, slow motion effects also. Now I played this game. This is a casual game, a fun game, and uh, it plays uh, without any issues on this uh, one. So this is Modern Combat 5, a popular FPS game. So let's see how it handles this one. And it's playing it fine. Um, and I expected that because it's having the Snapdragon 625 chipset, uh, which is good enough for gaming. Let's continue. The back is slightly getting warm, but not hot because it's uh, aluminium. But we will check the temperatures later on to see if it is exhibiting any heating issues. So continuing and it's playing this game without any issues as you can see so as you can see no issues with this game and regarding the speaker the earpiece is the speaker so it's from here just this one I wouldn't say it's the loudest speaker, but as it's a foreign firing speaker, uh, it's okay, I would say. I wished it was slightly louder. So as you can see, it's playing this game without any issues. Uh, let's check the temperatures. The surface temperature is about 28 degrees here. And on the screen, it's about 37, 38, as you can see. We could say that's almost 39. Yeah, 39, it did touch, 39.2. Let's look at the back and uh, this is again about 38 you could say on this camera lens also it's around that so about 38.5 that we are noticing third al almost 39 at the back let's just get out of this game now and uh, let's move to asphalt 8 and see how it uh, plays that one so this is asphalt 8 and let me show you the graphic settings and uh, we're going to play it at the highest graphic uh, settings so we are going to play this uh, Tokyo level and I'm using the on-screen steering. And as you can see guys, I kept it on the highest graphic setting. And this is a demanding level, so if there is lag, it will be exhibited on this level. We're getting all the graphics as you can see. So far so good. We'll also check the temperatures because generally after asphalt 8, most of the phones tend to get uh, pretty warm. We'll test that one also on this. But so far, as you can see, it's playing this game very well. And there I noticed some minor frame drops as you saw. So as you can see it's playing it fine but uh, I wouldn't say it's completely lag free. I did notice uh, frame drops at times but it's not like always just happened uh, once or twice on this uh, level. I'm trying the drift as you can see. 
and for the most part it's handling it fine we will uh, check the temperatures also so we finished that level let's look at the temperatures now and here ambient temperatures are about 28 on the back as you can see about uh, 38.9 that's almost 39 yes 39 degrees celsius it's registering uh, around the camera yeah it's 39 40 also yeah across if you go at this end it's uh, about 40 at the edges so yeah that's what it is so 40 is the max that we are seeing let's look here on the screen and uh, this one is also yeah it did touch 41.4 maximum that uh, we are uh, noticing so yeah it can go up to about 42 degrees uh, celsius so let's get out of this one and let's move to nova 3 and see how it handles that one so this is nova 3 and let's see how it handles uh, this game and we'll also check the temperatures after finishing this level So it's handling it fine as of now as you can see. So I noticed no lag as of now on this Nova 3. I'm happy to say that uh, there is no lag on this Nova 3 even when there was a lot of action so this level is finished let's look at the temperatures again and ambient temperature is about 27.6 and here as you can see on the screen it's about 30 38 it did touch yeah 38.9 so we could say that's almost 20 39 degrees Celsius here on the screen let's look at the back and uh, here it is now about 38.4 let's look near the camera uh, that's about 38 so the max temperature we saw was actually in asphalt it did touch almost 42 degrees celsius but here with nova 3 as you can see it's about 38.5 to 39 degrees celsius uh, so what do i feel uh, regarding the gaming performance with this moto g5 uh, plus actually the gaming performance was uh, very good but yes it was not completely lag free with the asphalt 8 uh, i did notice lag uh, twice minor for a couple of seconds then it went away so overall i would say it could run heavy games also like nova 3 and modern combat without any issues so i feel it's a good handset for uh, gaming yes uh, with asphalt a, uh, 8 it did touch about 42 degrees uh, celsius uh, and it does feel a bit warm to touch because the back is aluminium but again i don't feel uh, it's overheating because we have seen many devices going over 45 degrees celsius that is very uncomfortable but 42 yes it will feel a bit warm but i feel uh, that's fine i'll also be posting other videos on the moto g5 plus for example many of you have asked me to do the camera review and compare it with the moto g4 plus i will be posting that uh, video uh, very soon so stay tuned to my channel and if you're not subscribed to my youtube channel hit that subscribe button thanks for watching this is ranjit and i hope to see you in my next video